Hey guys, welcome back to some more Xenoblade Chronicles. Alright, so, <laughs> uh, I went off screen or off camera last night, because uh, <laughs> I'm freaking, I'm enjoying this game so much, just wandering around doing like little things. So, holy shit, I went back and I did all the fucking Collectopedia stuff. I couldn't do the Bionis interior for obvious reasons. <laughs> we have to go back there later. I did Satoru Marsh, Ether Mine, Colony 6, all that sh good stuff. I had to Google some of the locations because they were really hard to find. Some of the collectibles. I also... This, this is so unnecessary, but I... I needed to do this, because I hated seeing quests that weren't done. So I went back and got all the quests done that I had accepted over the course of this playthrough. <laughs> so yeah, that's just a few things I did. I completed the... what's it called? The Maconis Field map. There was this one area that I missed the spent fuel tank, you had to like jump in there. And there was also this one place I want to show off real quick. The Machina Refuge. I completely missed this place. But there was a cool shop here with uh, really good um, Machina weapons and good equipment for Fiora. So yeah. <laughs> this place was like, it was I don't know how I missed it. It was kind of... I don't know. It was a little bit out of the way, but it wasn't too bad. I think if I spent more time in the last episode or the last two episodes just exploring more, I could have found it, but... Whatever. <laughs> this episode, we are going to be taking on the Central Factory. Oh boy. I got up a few levels too, I think. Yeah, we're at 65 now. So, holy shit. <laughs> also, you might notice Shulk is running faster. I didn't realize I had a quick step 5 gem in my inventory, so I figure, heck, <laughs> if it makes Shulk go faster, then why the fuck not, right? Anyways, let's actually progress with the episode here. Make sure my camera's focused. All oh, right. So what are we doing here in the central factory? We have to... We have to get to the transporter. So we gotta find our way around. I'm guessing we have to go up here. There was an area up near the front that I couldn't get to. It had like one of those switches, but they're red, so... I'm guessing we have to activate that switch somehow. <laughs> it's the worst. <laughs> Where's the onions? I fucking love the onion enemies. They... <laughs> it's so dumb. Hey, SA. <laughs> Beast. A mild Florence. I kind of want to leave the unique monsters, just in, just in case there's a quest tied to them. Uh, seriously? Is there nothing up here? Other than these fuckers? What did I just say? Not right now. I guess I can go back here. Now that I'm doing the Collectopedia stuff, I guess I'm going to need, a. Uh... Oh! He almost aggroed me. I'm going to need all this stuff. So what the hell? I went the wrong way? Let me head to the other landing strip then. The one over here. Let's go, Shulk. I'm going to play as Shulk for now. I just... <laughs> Mainly because I have the quick step gem on him, but I don't know. He's the main character. I just feel like playing as Shulk through this part. Uh. 
Okay, obviously this is where I'm supposed to go. <laughs> I love when they do this. It's like... What does this remind me of? <laughs> it's kind of like where you put your luggage on an airport, kind of. We're just luggage at this point. <laughs> uh, the maintenance entrance. It says we're... What the hell? It says this is where we're supposed to be. Maybe down here? Oh god! Shulk! Fuck! I'm an idiot. That's why there's a ladder thing there. <laughs> Fuck! No! They're gonna make me go all the way back? Oh, you've gotta be kidding me. Well, get comfortable, guys. I'm gonna have a fucking <laughs> drink of water while I get myself back here. Oh my god. Leave it to me to do the dumbest shit. I should be over there by now. I'm excited though because the story is starting to get really like in depth now. And I really can't wait to see where this shit goes. Because like I said, this plot is crazy. And I think it takes more than one go through to really understand it. I had a very hard time understanding the full plot on the 3DS. Mainly because there's so much information <laughs> to pay attention to. So I'm hoping this time around, when all the big revelations happen, I'll be able to understand it better. I was mentioning I was mentioning this in in another episode, I think, but the Monado stuff still confuses me a little bit. Like the fact that there's like three Monados or something. There's like this Monado, it's like Zanza's Monado. And then we have like Alvis, who is a, also a Monado. And then Shulk himself has a Monado or something. <laughs> it's so fucking confusing. I can't I can't understand all of it. Maybe I just don't pay enough attention. A faithful Lancelot. It looks like we're gonna have to take him down. and an agony plate. What? Is this not what I was supposed to do? So I didn't have to kill him? Okay. Now what? <laughs> I thought this is where I was supposed to go. Let's go this way then. I did a little bit of crafting last night too when I was playing this. I don't have, um, I don't know, I'm not huge, <laughs> I'm not a huge crafter. As long as I have, like, strength up gems, ether up gems, ether defense gems, HP gems, agility gems, shit like that, I'm okay with the other stuff not being a thing. I don't know. That's just how I play this game.
a diary. An offensive diary. Ryan's laugh, I swear to God. <laughs> so what does this do then? Oh God, it's Zord. <laughs> or it's a bunch of Zords. Okay, we opened up the hangar. What's this? Okay, this is what I was supposed to do. Okay. <laughs> it's exactly like the world tree, I swear to God. <laughs> with the doors and everything. With enemies coming out of them. So do we have to kill those things down there? I'm assuming not. Oh, shit. Are they all unique monsters? Oh, no. I don't feel prepared to fight them. Oh, shit. I wanted the collectibles. I just wanted the collectibles. There's a chest! I gotta get away from this. I gotta get away from this situation. I want that chest. Oh god. Hold on. A beast. Okay. That unique monster was like the same level as me, so I don't feel too confident fighting him. <laughs> I usually fight unique monsters if they're a few levels under me. Wait, where the fuck am I going now? What is this? What? Oh! A fairy? Is it like a Zelda fairy? <laughs> Will it bring me up if I die? <laughs> Obviously not. So what? I have to fucking fight the beautiful Vagul? That's two pieces of black styrene. Whatever that is. Alright, I'm gonna take out the little guys. Whoa, 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 whoa. Attack Ryan. I'm gonna die! Thank you, Charlotte. Wait. Oh, fuck it. Oh, fuck, I should have used break. Oh, I gotta focus on the little guys, but I, I can't seem to get them. Focus your attack, Ryan. Fuck off! Ah, oh, I'm gonna die. 
Get that fucking chain attack. I'm terrified right now. Uh, get Shulk back up here. I've got this. Nice. Now get rid of this fucking fairy thing. I should have took out that fairy thing first. I feel like he was causing me a lot of problems. I feel like I should check out some of this equipment. Hold on. What did I get? I got, uh... An Agrius Helm. Who can... Oh my god! That's really good for Shulk. Ooh. Lock on resist? Ooh, I could do with that. I don't think I really got too much else from that. That helmet's pretty important, though. I think I'm going to have to end the episode here, though, guys. I got some shit I got to get done, and, uh, <laughs> fuck. I wish I could make this episode longer, but I just wanted to sit down and record for a little bit, so. Yeah. <laughs> I guess in the next episode, we will continue the Central Factory. Sorry this episode was a little shorter, but, yeah, we'll continue this next time. So, I'll see you guys then. Peace.